We've conducted over 200 million tests. Think of that, 200 million tests, more than all of the European Union combined. It's not even close. Just 10 months ago, none of these innovations even existed. The tremendous progress that we've made is a testament to what our nation is capable of. When America is faced with a challenge, we come through, and we always come through to overcome every hardship and surmount every obstacle. And I think you'll be seeing that over the next few months. Uh, the numbers should skyrocket downward. American companies were the first to produce a verifiably safe and effective vaccine. Together, we will defeat the virus, and we will soon end the pandemic, and we will save millions and millions of lives, both in our country and all over the world. And we've already started. Thank you again to every person here today and for the incredible achievements uh, that you've done. You're going to be very proud of this day, and you're going to be very proud of this period of time, because nobody thought this was possible. Nobody thought it was even remotely possible to do what we've done in a period of less than nine months, uh, something that just not uh, even thinkable. And uh, we took a lot of heat when we said this is our goal, and we frankly weren't even quite uh, using the numbers that we use. We far exceeded what we thought. If we would have said sometime next year, I think most people would have said that would be great, that would be a miracle. Uh, but we did it long before sometime next year. So now I want to ask several leaders who have been crucial in this effort to join me on stage as I sign the executive order to ensure that American citizens have first priority to receive American vaccines, and then we're going to be working with other countries all over the world. And I think we'll be able to start doing that almost immediately also, because we have millions of doses coming in. So uh, thank you very much. Thank you. It's a great honor. Thank you very much, everybody. Thank you. Thank you.